From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Emily Luxon with your news headlines. Ten men and one woman are behind bars after a prostitution sting in Clarksville. All 11 people are facing various charges, including patronizing prostitution. The police department's special operations unit posted an ad online targeting people who provide or solicit sexual services in exchange for money. Undercover officers met the people who answered the ad and negotiated prices for services and arrested them. Just in time for Christmas, TSU football player Christian Abercrombie reaches a major milestone in his recovery. Christian's mom, Stacy, says he graduated from his rehabilitation center. He'll now start outpatient therapy next week and is able to go home. Stacy said, quote, we are so thankful for what God has done. Abercrombie collapsed during a football game against Vanderbilt back in September. It's a busy weekend for holiday travelers, especially at Nashville International Airport. Officials project more than 29,000 people will show up at BNA this weekend alone. That's up about 10% compared to last year. To avoid additional holiday stress, make sure you arrive two hours before your flight and check your flight status before heading to the airport. Now let's get a look at your forecast from meteorologist Henry Rothenberg. Clouds are going to increase overnight, Emily, along with some slight chances for scattered showers to start your Sunday. Still kind of there around the midday part. Overnight we fall to 40, which is fairly mild, and we'll see a cloudy sky and 49 for the high temperature come Sunday. Here's a look at that forecast taking you through Christmas Day. Slight chance we could see a shower Christmas, but the real concern will be for some thunderstorms come Thursday.